What Best a competition. Now, it's time to meet another soap legend. And this week, Sharon Marshall is off to find a dingle in the Dales. It's a bit noisy in here. Abby. Is that all done? My quest to celebrate soap royalty wouldn't be complete without a trip to the beautiful Yorkshire Dales, where I'm meeting a matriarch. Emmerdale women are a force of nature, and in this village, you have to be. Today's legend has survived sieges, helicopters, love wrapped men, and a whole load of heartache. You really think you're getting out of here after everything you've done? Just go! Oh. You had a single shred of decency! Oh, yes, that's right. It's the one and only Emmerdale legend, Chaz Dingle, played by Lucy Pargeter. Yeah, going to the Dingles! Lucy has played Chaz for over 20 years and dealt with everything you can imagine. Just get in my stride, love! Today, she's taken a break to chat to us here, the Dingle Homestead. She's got a pint waiting in a welly. This is going to be good. Lucy, thanks so much for joining us. You are welcome. I am so excited. You you came when you were going soap legends, but you are. No. Just Dingle is. No, I'm a fraud. I feel like I shouldn't be here. It's ridiculous. Not only does it make me feel old, but there are other people in this show that I think deserve it a lot more. You have been on our screens now as Chastity Dingle for over 20 years. Now, there is a, a lot to discuss. I think the role that you were born to play yeah. is... is Chaz. Chaz. We are here today in the iconic Dingle homestead. Yes, it's it so is home. It's the heart no, of the Dingles. It's really where like we all congregate at times of, of, of need, really. For some gosh. reason, something that you did in that audition made them think, <laughs> we've got a stripper arriving <laughs> dressed as a nun. <laughs> I didn't know that that's how I was going to arrive. <laughs> Everybody of Emmerdale was there. It was a big Dingle do. Oh, yes! Well, it wasn't long before you started getting to grips with quite a few of the local men. Not that many. <laughs> well, when you put them all together, it does seem like quite a few over the years. <laughs> she is kind of like that hardcore kind of going for a bad boy type. Mm. But she wants love, she wants affection and stability, I think, underneath it all. While relationship stories have brought plenty of drama, there are some incredibly tough storylines Lucy has had to portray on screen. We were just hit with this massive story in 2008. Danny Miller. It's a groundbreaking story in the way that um, we, they, the show explored abuse. To explore that, it was a massive responsibility on Danny, and he just smashed it. He was incredible. And another storyline that also just made us cry when we're watching, we're, we're coming to 2019 and Paddy and Chaz and their little baby. I myself had just had the twins, so I just had the blessing of these two small children to then have to go through losing a child on the screen. It was the first time that I think I've actually sobbed properly doing a storyline and not been able to stop when, we, when they said cut. That was a beautiful story to tell, but it was one of the hardest that I've done, I think. No Talk of the Dingles is complete, of course, without a mention of Steve Hallowell. Kid, you wanted us here, now spell it out. I almost sat in Zach's chair yes, that we've Zach's got chair. over there. We've moved them around so that I am not sitting in, in Zach's chair. Zach's chair should remain Zach's chair, and nobody should sit in it. That's the Dingle way. He is and forever will be the head of the family, and he is and will always be missed greatly by all of us. Chaz has had to deal with a lot over the years, and her latest storyline is one of her toughest. So Chaz has gone through breast cancer. She's just gone through a double mastectomy on, on screen. Tell me a little bit what it's been like to, to film that storyline. So my job is, is one of being Chaz, really. She doesn't know what to expect. She doesn't know what's going to happen, and she doesn't know how to play each situation. So I try and play it as her. We do need to do a biopsy, so it is cancer. It's been difficult, but I know where it's going and it's going to be 
brilliant the way it's going. Do you like it this way? Do you like the I drama? I love it this way. <laughs> if I turned up to work and all I had to do was, can I get you a pint? I would, I would definitely not have the love and passion that I do for my job as I, I do right now. Well, the one thing you've never been is boring. Thank you so much. You're more than welcome. For sitting down and talking about your soap life and we can't wait to see what happens next. Thank you Thank very you. much. I still think I'm a fraud. <laughs> <laughs>《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《》《